Yes, I am in fact still sitting here listening to this fuck. Hopefully it would end. It turns out it doesn't. So I'm gonna leave and no longer listen to that and get inside the new town. So I don't know how many times I've told the recruits not to very rude of you to just breeze past me like that, but I get it. I'm just a gate guard. Who cares about me? It's fucked up, bro. I was gonna listen when I came back. That's smash. Smash. Well, goddamn, that, there, there's Douglas right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot. All right. Yeah, I, I'd love to, you know, sell something everybody likes, like chocolate. But no, I'm, I'm, my passion lies with sounding rods. So that's what I sell. Is uh, I just sell rods. You stick up your dick. That's me. <laughs> I just saw Rod just stick up your dick. You know, at least he loves what he does. That's all you can ever ask for. Oh, I hope we don't have to meet Douglas. Yeah, jeez. That guy scares the shit out of me. He was trying to play Gary alive at the party last night. He should <laughs> Honestly, Gary's a racist. How much money did Oreos pay for that ad? I am in no way affiliated with Nabisco or the parent company Montelez International. <laughs> Motherfucker. That was really just an ad. Damn, can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? Which, I mean, I, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's a good place to hide out. I mean, but yeah. Whoa, look at that. Look at that. They got, they're, they're fucking dealing with some greebles over there. Dumb fucks. I like how he calls them dumb for dealing with greebles. Okay, shit, I, I guess let's just kill them all. Yeah. Killing these weak fucks doesn't do anything for me. Sir. Fuck you, G3 scum. One less G3 to worry about. training facility maybe douglas does the training in person hey drooling julian <laughs> look we're just gonna love what he's doing because he's so horny it's like tex avery wolf thing he's a hot alien he just starts salving like a cartoon dog he's been neutered like a real dog <laughs> oh really julian it's you and me bounty hunter hey watch where you're going hey watch where you're going Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy, I promise. I, I don't like the way you look, sound, or behave, bruh. Hey, hey there. Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You want us uh -huh. to get the G3 facilities? Yeah, I gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality. So, you, you want some goop, right? Give us the goop. Uh, you know what? Yes. Fuck it. How about, how about a big fat yes? Goop Let's me, go. my man. Perfect. Head down the alley there. Just uh, let the magic happen, I guess. Uh, don't don't worry. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goop stuff. Oof. Oh, my God. Oh, gee. Oh, my God. Not, not what I was thinking it would be. Yeah, but it's dookie. Throw up. Okay, okay, I'm all right. Okay. Oh my god. Th this better fucking work. Hey, look at you. You're all gooped up. I gotta be honest. It won't last long. It's not the real stuff. So you better be quick. Get in. Get out. Don't stay in there too long. Don't lollygag. Cause this stuff's gonna fall off. That's the goop guy. Promise. That's the guarantee. Okay. Thank you. Let's just go. Let's just go. Oh, looky here. We got another gooped up G3 recruit. Um, but I gave G3 birth. Cartel is not responsible for any life threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. It was really crazy. The drink tough. No idea what happened to the kid I had. The kids I had. Good luck. Thanks. Are you fucking kidding me? They have some whole thing prepared. Shut the fuck up. It's starting. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm sure you already know who I am, but for anyone living under a rock, I'm Douglas.
as G3 Chief of Training and Torture. And wouldn't you know it, I like to blur those lines a little. Training? Torture? What's the difference, I say? Look to your left. Now look to your right. Both of those people are gonna die today. You are about to jump right into an accurate warp-based simulation of what it'll look like to be on the real battlefield. And let me tell okay. you, you're probably gonna die. But hey, if you don't, you get to join the G3. Big whoop. All right, that's it. Lock and load, fuckers. Oh my god, is All that... Right, you saw up. that, right? I got that was a Gatlian. To Douglas has a Gatlian. We, we, we gotta rescue her. Jesus, these fucking Merkeloids. Oh, fuck, here we go. I, here we shit, go. I hope it's not too difficult. Die, you creepy crawly bastard. I hope this is the last... Whoa, don't shoot me. Shoot the bad guy. Obstacle course. Okay, you know what? It looks like some simple platforming, you know, like what you'd see in like Lucky's Tale on, uh, you know, or um, you know, that one, uh, that one game. Really? You got hurt? Cause that, lo that looked like it should have been easy. Shit, this must be the beginner course. Come on. I'm slipping. I'm slipping. I'm slipping. I'm slipping. I'm slipping. Ah! Listen, you're not gonna impress me if you if you if you get through this. It's, it's pretty simple. <laughs> I have a pacemaker. One zap would kill me. Hey, you go on ahead. Okay, l let's just get this over with, please. Whew, fucking get that fucking jump. God damn, that was a little that, that we we made it. That was a little tough though. Congratulations, shitheads. So you made it past the first training exercise. Big deal. I... That one was easy. We lied and said it was hard to scare you. But it was fun to freak you out, to fuck with your heads. Now get ready for exercise two. It starts in one hour. That's right, you have to wait a full hour. We're testing your resolve. So just stand there patiently and wait. Then this door will open and you can continue. Uh, okay, there's no way we're waiting a full hour. Yeah, no. Okay, thank God. Okay, let, let's ditch this whole recruiting bullshit thing. Turns out you can wait the whole hour. I would like to see how that does, but for obviously, you know, gameplay sake, we're not fucking doing that. Let's be, let's be real with each other, okay? I would love to do it, but I'm not about to sit here an hour and do that. Maybe on like a second oh, playthrough, I come back and do it. There goes that bootleg goop. Uh, I guess that didn't last for very long. Oh my God! Hello! Thank God you're here. My name's Doctor Jupy. Douglas kidnapped my whole Jupy. family, and I'm trying to sneak in and save them. But I just can't get through these pipes in the next room. Oh my God! I'm freaking out. Hey, whoa, whoa, l l listen, little guy. We're trying to find Douglas too. You know, maybe we can help each other. God, I'm so worried. I'm gonna, gonna throw up. You really help me? Oh, gee, I'm, I'm so grateful. This fucking creature is terrifying. You gotta connect these pipes for me. So I can get through and save my family. Hey, don't worry. This is a classic textbook puzzle situation. I think me and my bounty hunter partner can figure this one out. Don't even worry. Oh, how wondrous. I'm forever in your debt. I don't know how... Wow! You did it! You got the door open! Listen. I'll never forget this. You're my personal hero. Oh, come on. You're too, I got you, you're too kind. It, it was easy. Oh, did you say you're heading to find Douglas too? His office is that big building up on top of Dregtown. But there's a zip line just past here that'll take you right to him. Thanks, troops. Huh. Well, all right then. I, I, I hope the guy gets his family back. Same. What is this? 
Congratulations to all of you worms who made it this far in your training. It is now time for the final test. A bloody free-for-all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shit heels. God damn it, another fucking thing with this. Holy shit, just kill them all. Slice his throat. Done. Slicey, slicey. Die, bro. We did it. We're with the number one G three recruit. We, we, we could be in the G three if we wanted to be. Woo! We could be. Could be. Congratulations, graduates on joining the G3 or whatever. I really can't stress enough how little I give a shit. Now report to your commanding officer and we'll send you off to die fighting for us on whatever dumbass planet we decide. See ya. Fuck yeah! He's showing me around town. Bloom's pretty cool, honestly. This whole thing would actually be a whole lot of fun if, you're in, if our entire home planet wasn't getting destroyed right now. Alright, let's do a cooldown lap. I hate the fact you stroke him for this shit, bro. I hate it. Oh, I'm with it. Oh, it's you. Oh, you again. Am I glad to see you? I'm so happy we keep running into each other. Oh, look who it's our old buddy. It's our old friend, Dr. Jupy. What are you talking about? How, wh how's it going? Oh, there's another locked door. I'm running out of time. God, I'm so worried about my kids. And a little bit about my wife, but mostly my kids. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Oh, my poor kids. I hope Douglas doesn't kill them. I can feel my wife Plymouth calling for me. You're gonna solve this one, too. Thank you. Fuck. Swoopy and Froopy would really like you to. Oh, they're good kids. I can't wait to introduce them to you and tell them about everything you did for me. They need good, strong role models. Oh, Plimmy and the kids are probably so scared without me. That kind of took forever. There's a lot of confusing shit in here, bro. Amazing! Amazing! You did it again! Douglas's office isn't too far from here. I'm going on ahead. I'll see you there! Jesus Christ, Douglas yeah, is gonna kill Dr. Jupy. Look, look how weak and, and cute Dr. Jupy is. Forget about it. Yeah, he is. Fuck me. Oh. This is an urgent announcement. This sector has temporarily been designated as a mother's floor and against violence zone. That means there's probably just going to be a lot of violence. An intruder has infiltrated the G3 recruitment program, and there will be lots of violence here until we find and kill them. And remember, always eat your vegetables. You know what? That looks like I'll Douglas's eat your office, but we can't get in that way. We're, maybe we can go around back. Let's do it. Oh, that's fucking gorgeous. That a black car. That's an event horizon. Oh, man. This is right on the precipice of an event horizon. That's fucking awesome, dude. This pistol now does what? Double damage now? Fuck yeah, dude. I never, I didn't say it, but this game is a really, really cool fucking concept. Like the alien part isn't, isn't like the crazy, craziest thing we've ever fucking seen ever. You know what I'm saying? Like, but like, you know, like the, the aliens aren't a crazy thing, but it's the fact that it talks. Like your character doesn't talk, it talks. And it's Justin's Roiland's voice. It's the it's the Morty voice. So basically, this entire time you just you listen to fucking Morty the whole time, just fucking cursing you out like, "Yo, stop trying to kill people." It's really fun. I, I really like this game. is fucking amazing. To be honest, ten out of ten.
I wish those animations were a little bit more smooth. Maybe it's just because this game doesn't prioritize frame rate, it prioritizes graphics. Slice. I'm excited for you to meet Tweeg. Just don't say anything at all that might embarrass me, okay? At least the game has, at least the game has topical humor as well. Like, it's very on the nose. Like, oh, you never say anything. You're my brother. Dr. Jupy, you're still alive. Oh, oh my, my best fucking friends. god. This is Douglas is right beyond this door. Can you help me out one last time? Yeah, let's do this. Oh, my God. Plimmy, Froopy, Sloopy, here I come. Here we go. Oh, you're so good at these. I wish I was as good at these as you. You're really good. Did you go to puzzle school? Nope, I'm just really fucking good at puzzles, bruh. the next one but uh yes you're halfway there keep yes, going you can uh, do it oh i can't wait to see my little flimmy proppy and droopy <sighs> where the fuck is he from really here really go trying up. not to think about my wife's body being ripped in half by one of douglas's torture devices and it's not working to be honest Go, 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 Power Rangers. Da, na, 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 na. Go, go, Power I've decided Rangers. that if my family is da, dead, na, I'm going to kill na, myself na. and join them in the afterlife. Don't talk me out of it. This is what love does to a person. Oh my fucking god, what am I doing? You're a good team. How the fuck? So he goes through there. Ah, it doesn't go into the wall, it goes down there. Well, shit! D does that mean he's... Huh? I, I feel pretty stupid right about now. He was fucking with us! Bad. We got played! Look at us! We got played! We fell for it! Damn it! I think it's funny. This game is real funny. <laughs> oh, fuck off! <laughs> I was never Dr. Jupy. There is no Dr. Jupy. Are you shocked, you idiot? You complete fucking moron! Oh, of course you are. <laughs> That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> really nice to see you again. Oh. Get out of here! Shit! Let's go look at this guy. I did that a lot, man. G3 Guardian graduation defeat Douglas. <sighs> all right. Oh, this you is his body. trying to get me all excited and withhold the beef. Ah, fuck yeah, that's definitely the stuff. <laughs> oh, now that felt good. Oh, yeah, I hate him so much. Nice. flesh, actually. It was actually very nice. What is this? 
sweezy. All right, dipshit, let's go. What? No hello? Nice to meet you, or thank you for saving me? Why? Like you not dying there with some sort of favor to me? Hi, I'm Sweezy. Thank you so much for rescuing me. How is that, dipshit? Now come on, use my time bubble to escape through the big fan in the corner. Ah, time bubble. That's cool. Hey, if you huh. want to slow down time, it's really cool, right? You're gonna find out real fast that I'm the best Gatlian, smartest, most useful, best looking. No, no, come on, come on, I'm pretty good. Douglas, it's Garmentuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a complete <laughs> fool of yourself at that party last night. Not good, Douglas. Not oh, God. good. I'm gonna oh, come your game now we've got on that sound. We're spread thin over on Earth, and I need more troops immediately. Not to mention, things are gonna start heating up all over the galaxy as demand goes up. Big things are happening, Douglas. Get excited and get your fucking shit together. Okay, yeah, that's rude. Fuck that. Why does it have buttholes for fucking where the damn shit goes? You want to fuck these guys up? Who gives a shit? Stop that, Gunner! I hate these idiots! Hey, you want to know my real hat trick? My crystal stick in the bag and they'll explode if you hit them real hard. My Twister knife? You get it. Go nuts! We make a pretty good game! Already? I was just getting into it. You just made a big mistake, asshole. Aim me at those fuckers and I'll charge up your super quick. Too easy. <laughs> bubble can do great perfect now hurry and cross before it wears off incredible right what a thrill you know you can use that time bubble on the g3 too and try loading the bubble up with my <sighs> we're gonna make a good team i can feel it just listen to everything i say and never use the other gatlians <laughs> That's funny. Farting freely. Just a guy who farts, nothing too special, not even that funny, but yeah, he does absolutely just farts all the time, constantly. He does it on purpose, too. He pushes him out, even when he doesn't know got to do it. He's sick in the head. What a nasty fuck. Oh, come on, bro. So what's next? You turn in the bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap this up. I want to get the jetpack next, because that would be great. The jumbo heist. They're gonna jumble around and heist. I swear to God, the jumbo heist. Jumble around. Come on, good. Get over here. Gonna watch a bunch of jumbly heist people, and these aliens. Check this out. That's Club Nuggle, Blim City Magistrate. No, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs. What's he trying to do? I'll be the first to admit we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. Yeesh, desperate much? Can you even help us? I already told you you go. Oh, great. No, don't start. Trust me. He's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head through there. Clug's expecting you. Okay. Not gonna hey, do that. I'm gonna go do other things. Go talk to Clug. Jesus. Oh, God damn it. It's like that. Okay, I'll do this and that's the end of this video.
Oh, hey, little guy. Thank you so much for coming, bounty hunter. It wasn't really our idea, but hey. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're just a big ass threat. lips. My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Uh, no. We're Gatlians. Unless you're talking about my personal chauffeur. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could the focus fuck? more time on the G3. But you... You've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me. But there's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. He's lying. What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Why is You'll she talking to us now? You like. The view is breathtaking. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. Yo! Oh. <laughs> hey, well, well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Okay. Yep. And he even gave us this weird thing we could save humans with. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Bordeaux's chef stand too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Tammy and the T-Rex, Denise Richards. Now let's go get this goddamn jetpack, and that'll be the end of this video. Yo, Mr. Keith, got any jetpacks back there? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, uh, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Nice. Don't we get a jetpack now? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it re ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Oh, way to rip us off. Guess we'll wait. Not like we have a choice. Let's go tell Gene. He's literally a needler, which I really enjoy. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Kind of. That cheapskate mister keeps making us wait till he gets it in stock. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? When he's right, he's right. Let's get a cat nap in. This is your bedroom? Okay. Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. That's so How weird. cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. I like how that just said Tuesday. Alright, 
partner. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Holy shit, this rules! Hey, what's up? Yeah. Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack bro. Nice. You could just hover, okay. Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off. Gene, like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fuck more aliens than your brain could comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? What? Oh, come on. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me, you don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six, and he's really nice to me. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great. <laughs> Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. <laughs> That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look. We've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. Excuse me. He's just trying to help. <laughs> no, he is. sorry, but I am not about to let this fuck-up degenerate school me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a fuck-up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you on life decisions. I, I know better than anyone what not to do. You're both assholes. Yeah, well, you're going to get this tweed guy pregnant. And then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. Then who's gonna have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? Me! Yeah, not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, Grimble Dick. Ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Twig. Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. She can. She can date whoever she wants. Thank you. Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just That's fucked up. clean up, Gene. Okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Cool. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed those episodes. I finally got a jet back, so I'm going to go fucking do some things. No. Screndel Brothers and Dr. Giblets. Ice hot. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to see you guys in the next episode of High on Life. I've been enjoying it. I'm going to go get some more of that, for, uh, the loot with the the goddamn the talking needler. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe if you are new here and you like it if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you all next one. Peace.